Secretary of State Mike Pompeo says that any attack on U.S. interests by Iran or U.S. citizens will be met with a swift and decisive U.S. response. The secretary says in a statement, quote, we do not seek war, but Iran's 40 years of killing American soldiers, attacking American facilities, and taking American hostages is a constant reminder that we must defend ourselves. Though Pompeo also points out that President Trump says he is willing to meet with Iran's leaders and try to work out their differences. What they should be doing is calling me up, sitting down. We can make a deal, a fair deal. We just don't want them to have nuclear weapons. Not too much to ask. And we would help put them back into great shape. They're in bad shape right now. Iran's response, no negotiations with the United States, and Americans would not dare take military action against Iran. That's according to a top Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps official speaking to Iranian state media. Despite an unspecified threat, the administration sped up the deployment of the USS Abraham Lincoln Carrier Strike Group to the Persian Gulf. Four B-52 bombers have also landed in the region. One year ago this week, the United States withdrew from the Iran nuclear agreement and then started reimposing sanctions that it had originally had lifted against Iran. The administration says it's going to continue the pressure. This week, it sanctioned Iran's metals sector. And the White House says with that, the U.S. has now sanctioned the top three exports from Iran, metals, oil, and chemicals.